What's up, Novi? Sanjay Gupta, a new teacher, and Freddie Fazbear on today's episode of the Cat's Eye News. Letard, and you're watching the Cat's Eye News. If you're planning on playing girls lacrosse in the spring, make sure to show up to the informational meeting on Tuesday, November 14th in Coach West's room, 243. There will be important information about the upcoming season, registration, conditioning, etc. If you can't come to the meeting, be sure to go visit Coach West for any information that you might need. It's easier because I know a lot of the kids in the school because I've been coaching track here for three years. So I'm not brand new. I walk down the hallway and I, I know people, which makes me a lot more comfortable. Outside of that, it's pretty much the same. It's just, and it's closer to my house. Because this is, um, this is where track wise, I've been home for the last few years and I don't want to leave that. I know it's a great school because my kids have gone through it. I, you know, I, it, this is this is where I wanted to be. And when the job opened up, I jumped at it. Yeah, yeah, it's 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 weird because the first couple days I was I was extremely nervous uh, walking around and you know because the school is um, it's kind of a maze. You get lost real quick, so I just stay to one hallway because I know it. But yeah, I got, got real comfortable real quick. I went to the Library Media Center and looked through some old yearbooks to find out more about a famous Novi High School alumni, American neurosurgeon Sanjay Gupta. He did a ton of things, and most of them are recorded in the yearbooks in black and white photos. He played tennis for several years, he played soccer, he was a part of the gardening club, he was also part of the Spanish club in the high school, he was in the National Honor Society, his senior year he was the vice president. He wasn't just a sports guy, he also did debate. There he is with the team. You're probably not ready for the next one. He was, wait for it, a theater person. That's right, he was an actor in the play You Can't Take It With You. Next section in the yearbook was senior superlatives. I looked through it and some of the categories were really odd. Cutest legs, teacher's pet, most conservative, and class flirts. But here is Sanjay. Most ambitious, class brains, and most likely to succeed. Yeah, no kidding. Senior graduation, he was class valedictorian. That's him, and that's him, and that's him. I'm going to look through so many old yearbooks and find so many photos of famous people that graduated from Novi High School. Here's a sneak peek, Mr. Knuckles and Mrs. Carter. Let me know if there's someone you want me to look up. See ya. What's going on, Novi? Welcome back to Cat's Eye Reviews. Today we're going to be reviewing Five Nights at Freddy's. I did not like this movie in the slightest, if I'm going to be honest. I know the lore, I've played the games, I've seen all the game theory videos, but it just was not good to me. There, the story kind of was all over the place, it wasn't as uh, interesting. Act 3 was the only enjoyable act for me, Act 1 and 2 were okay. The animatronics did look good though, it was very well done. The characters, I did not like. The story, like I said, was not as attention grabbing. There were just a lot of things I was kind of just like, why did they do this? this while they're leaving this out i just could not get with the movie but i still think you should check it out because a lot of people have if you especially if you know the lord a lot of people have liked the movie because of that but i would give the movie a 5.5 out of 10 if i'm gonna be honest but i still think you should check it out nonetheless we'll catch you later Novi. do you have a story that you want featured on the cat's eye news email us at nhscatseyenews at gmail.com just send us details, pictures, and videos, and we'll do the rest. Hey Wildcats, thanks for watching today's episode. Stay tuned tomorrow for our next episode. But in the meanwhile, Wildcats, I'll see you later.